it's been I gotta fix chat again Jesus Christ my time's hard to fix chat oh there it is <laughs> etc <cetera. clears throat> it's the guac's first time to our stream even though I've seen him before How's everybody doing? Good? <coughs> Karen's getting ready. So she'll be down in about 10 minutes, I guess. Something like that. And uh, we're going to do blindfold chess, hand and brain, and puzzle time, as the title of the stream indicates. Well, it's played every stream, the Glock Prodigy for the last 16 months or so. Maybe you forget it. Maybe you have some kind of amnesia. Thanks, Ace Deuce, for the sub. I turned the heat thing on because it's cold down here. So if you hear like a background, you know, whirling sound, it's not the treadmill. It's the it's heat, little heater thing I turned on. It's pretty far from here. But so maybe you don't even hear it. We have it on a lot, actually, because it's cold down here. Also, I think Aaron, Aaron, I think Karen turned on the, the, the air conditioning at some point today. Something like that. Yeah, they didn't indicate whether Joe Bava's children or his children's children were banned. Yeah, I don't. I, I got nothing. I, that's, that's Karen's job is to worry about other stuff that doesn't interest me at all. That's Karen's right up her alley. I haven't listened to what Joe Bavis said, and I'm never going to listen. I literally don't care. But from what other people said, it was pretty bad. Yeah, a lot of people were were injured and killed in Turkey and Syria. It's like one billion aftershocks. That's crazy. Got my tax return submitted. Good, good. Pretty early for that. Yeah, chess.com put out a public statement, and I learned something from their statement. I learned that Casa Corley works for chess.com. But henceforth, I, did, I didn't know that. Heretofore. So I, at least I learned something. I guess one way or another, everybody works for chess.com. I, I also have Perrier, and then I have coffee. It's, you know, the usual. We're not going to be on uh, Chess TV tonight, so there won't be as many viewers. So I can individually reply to your chats. Or I can reply to your individual chats, whichever makes more sense in English. I finished Chapter 2... Uh, my chessable course and the chessable guy said it was good. We have a lot of emails back and forth because I, like for two weeks, I didn't understand what format they wanted stuff in. And I had a lot of questions and they had a lot of doing everything wrong. The content's good. I just don't do it the way that they want me to do it. But now I know which way they want me to do it. After doing five or six different things wrong, which doesn't necessarily affect the effectiveness of the course. It just makes it confusing for them because I'm not doing it the same way everybody else is, but now I will. So starting with chapter three, they're going to be pretty happy because everything will be just normal. Yes, the chessable course is a complete repertoire for white playing 1d4 for beginning and novice players. 
So if it was me estimating, I would say beginner, like 100 to 1400. So if you're 100, you might find it difficult. You shouldn't. And if you're 1400, you might find it easy, although you might not. It's sort of for everybody. So there's some things that are, would be obvious to a 1400 that I say. And then there are things that wouldn't be obvious because, you know, let's face it, 1400 is, you know, pretty close to beginner. So. And based on how much time it's taking me, um, I think I'll be done by May 31st with the, the printed stuff, the chapters. And then I'm guessing it'll take me a month to do the videos. However, um, I'm going to be away in June to the National Open, then we're going to the World Series of Poker. So uh, thanks, Gramak, for the sub. So I'm going to try to finish it before the National Open, but I don't know if I can, but I'll try. And the National Open's like June 17th? And I'll be, I'll be there for four days at the National Open doing game analysis and simuls and chess camps and book, you know, sign stuff like a meet and greet. Uh, and then we're going back to Vegas the next week for the World Series of Poker. We'll be there for 11 days. Just I'll probably be playing mostly cash games, but Karen's going to play in you know, three or four events, I guess. And some cash games. Um, yeah. So that's what we'll be doing. Is it possible to be good at chess when you start playing at 18? Well, anything's possible. But if you want to get good at chess, I'm not saying you do, but if you do, then people who say things like, what opening should I play? And my rating is 1,200. How do I get to 1,400? And, you know, uh, my coach says this, but I don't want to do that. Or, you know, I lost five games in a row on chess.com, so I haven't played in a week. Those kind of things have nothing to do with getting better at chess. It's inquisitive of you, and that's what most people do. People who get better at chess, play chess, study chess, think about chess, love chess, and do chess stuff. People who don't get better at chess spend 90% of their energy thinking about how do I get better and asking questions about it. That's not how you get better at something. You want to get better at something, you do it and you work hard at it. And it's not just chess, that's your whole life. So this is a life lesson for you. Like if you wanna learn how to code or learn different computer languages, just go do it. Go on the internet and do it. It's easy to do, you just do it. But if you spend months asking people, how do I do it? What book should I buy? Is this language good to learn? Do you think I should do this or should I do something else? Then you're just like cheaty on the good place, which by the way, I, I finished. I watched the whole series, The Good Place, in about three and a half weeks. That was a good last episode, I thought. They wrapped up the series pretty well. But basically, 90% of questions from people who want to get better are like, what opening should I play? Is this a good opening? I'm 13 years old and I'm rated 1,000. Is that good? If that's what you're going to do with your life, you're not going to get good at anything. If you want to get good at stuff, you get good at it. You don't ask other people what their opinions are of whether you're good or not. That's, that's just you trying to get people to tell you you're good. That doesn't, there's no definition of good. You just, you, you, you do the best you can. So if you want to do the best you can, you got to do it. Asking people about it doesn't help you get better. Especially asking me, because I put you down. But basically, the problem people have in life, I don't mean in chess, I mean in life, but chess obviously is part of life. In fact, some would say it's more important, is people don't do stuff, they just talk about it. 
and they talk about how they're going to do it. That's, that's not how you accomplish things in life. You want to accomplish things in life, you do them. And then if it doesn't work out, you do something else. And you don't ask other people because other people will just tell you what they think that's usually about themselves. So, for example, like I want to lose weight, so I'm doing things to lose weight. And then a thousand random people who have never lost weight and don't know what weight is and don't know who I am and know nothing about anything, they weigh in and say, this is how you should lose weight. I, I don't care what you guys think about basically anything. I, I just want donations. So you, you guys are like, I think this and I think that. I don't know you. So you know what my wife thinks about stuff and my mom, my brother, uh, friends of mine that are close friends. I care what they think about stuff, but not people I don't know who say random nonsense. I, I, and the problem that you guys have is you give a lot of validity to nonsense. So instead of doing that, think for yourself do your own stuff. If you want to go to college and your friend's like, don't do that, man. Let's go get high. Okay, maybe they're right. Maybe that was a bad example. Okay, but you see my point is you should do what you want to do. Like, let's say your friend tells you to go to college and you're like, but I'm going to go get high. Okay, then, okay, now you're, now you're living your life. So you should do what you want to do and not ask other people what you should do. And that's you know, how you should live your life. And maybe if you have relatives or friends that you trust, which is weird because your relatives and friends are terrible, um, you know, you can ask them for advice. But they like to give unsolicited advice because that's what people like to do. So basically everybody's terrible. And that's why nobody gets into the good place. They're all in the bad place being tortured for eternity. Which as an atheist, I find very funny. Or you could get high in college. That's right. For example, I do a lot of things because that's what I do. I'm me. And then if you guys don't do that, or you've learned incorrectly usually that that's not a good thing to do, you like to give your opinion. For example, every stream... Somebody says, you're drinking coffee at night. You shouldn't do that. If you don't want to drink coffee at night, then don't drink coffee at night. That's up to you. I don't tell you to drink or not drink coffee. That's, you know, and, and, and Perrier, probably people aren't drinking as much Perrier as me. That's your loss. Terrible. I don't know how you could do that. How could you not drink Perrier? People keep challenging me, but I'm not playing anybody today. I'm not playing chess today. Always look at the title of the stream. I don't play people every day. How do I be exactly like you? The way to be exactly like me is to live your life and do what you want and don't let other people tell you what to do. Now do what I say. Fen Beingold gave five subs. Now that's, now we're talking. See that, you guys did good. Learn from Ben to ignore Ben, correct. But don't ignore Fen Beingold, that's different. Why are you not a comedic writer and producer? Why am I not? Because I'm a chess grandmaster. Sorry. Uh, Lior ACDF is gifting a sub. Thank you. To the real Disco Jesus. What about Disco Janet? She was one of the best Janets. Top three. Disco Janet. Most of my references are now about The Good Place because I just watched it. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's from The Good Place. If you saw The Good Place, if you've watched the whole series, I'm not saying you have, but if you have, in the final episode, near the end of the episode, uh, 
Ted Danson's guitar teacher, when he's actually human, is played by his actual wife, Mary Steenburgen. She's in the series for three minutes. So that was nice he got his wife in the series. Thanks, Big Daddy. Were you considered the strongest I am or the weakest GM? First, I was the strongest I am. Now I'm the weakest GM. First one, then the other. Yeah, Mary and Ted getting divorced on Curb was pretty funny. And then, and then Ted had to date uh, Larry's ex-wife. Truth hurts. Now, if I'm correct, I'm not saying I'm correct. The woman who plays Larry's ex-wife, well, first his wife, then his ex-wife, on Curb, in real life, she's married to a Kennedy. And he's like a crazy guy. Shocking. She, like, denounced something that he said. She's like, that's ridiculous. And, you know, I, yeah, the bad Kennedy. Probably more than one. The anti-vax one. Yeah. What's funny is I know one of the Rockefellers pretty well. Um, I think it's the vice president, the guy who was the vice president. I guess that was Nelson. His, his nephew, I think. I think it's his nephew. And um, he's, a, he's a chess benefactor. He gives money to Scholastic Chess, and he's on, like, the board of the U.S. Chess Scholastic Committee and stuff like that. And he's watched my stream and said he likes my stream. Maybe he's never watched my stream, but he seemed like he enjoyed the stream when he was talking to me about it. So he's probably not making me feel better. He probably does watch the stream sometimes. Fen Beingold gifted a sub. Thank you. How did I get into streaming? I don't know. We just started doing it like from the chess club when we owned the chess club. Even before we owned the chess club. Go Fen. Go Hype Train. Boy, Rockefeller hates Trump. God damn. I thought I hated Trump, but then Rockefeller came in and explained how to hate Trump more. Yeah, I'm not, I don't think cannibals are vegans, so I'm against it. Come on, hype train. We're one thing away. We can't have Fen Beingold just, you know, controlling the hype train. Other people must help. Now, if you're a cannibal and you only eat non-vegans, like you wouldn't eat a vegan, you'd only eat a non-vegan because you consider yourself vegan and you're saving other animals. I, I, could, I could work with that. Thanks, um, Leto Artreides314. That sounds like somebody who lives in St. Louis. Thanks for the 500 bits. Just because 314. My phone number starts with 314. Yay, we're at level three. That's pretty good. It's Karen. How's it going? Hooray. I turned the heat on because I was freezing. Oh. Uh, I was telling them how terrible they all were. Yeah. Yeah, and they were like, yeah. What did the they train do? started. What? What did they do wrong? You know, they're just beating themselves. Am I, I'm 14 years old. It, what, that's right? I think they... It's, it's on the right thing. Well, I just meant I'm cut off. Oh. And you're already way over there. So, so. let's move the camera? Yeah. Ugh. Well, okay. Let's probably do it that way. Might have gotten jounce from the cleaners. That's probably what That's, happened. yeah. Yeah, okay. No, That's but, fair. but, but, uh, no, but I get a lot of questions over and over again. Mm -hmm. And one of them is, I'm X years old and my rating is X. Can I get good at chess? You know... Kidding me? Well, I mean, the correct answer is no, but you don't want to hear that. 
Don't ask questions you don't want to hear the answer to. Just, just study chess and play chess. Don't be asking me how to get better at chess. That's how you get better at anything. What did you put the... Uh, Toro down? Scorpio subscribe. Thank you. What's your question? Did you put the white balance in something different? 5350. Oh, okay, that's good. Go vegans. Thanks, McNubbits. 180 bits. Judge Judy is only 80 years old. Only? Mm -hmm. That's too bright. Duh. See, like the chessable course, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. So I did it wrong, and they said that's wrong. Do it another way. Then I did it the way they told me, and they said, that's wrong. And then we had some emails, and then he says, okay, I think you understand now. So chapter three, I'll do it the way I think they want me to do it. And that won't affect the quality of chapters one and two, but it's fun to annoy them a little bit. Give them something to do. I mean, I think everything's going normally. Yeah, the 10,000 hours thing is from Malcolm Gladwell. It's a random number he made up. See, that's the problem is you guys believe other people and other people are dumb. Like Malcolm Gladwell is a good example. Most of his books have been discredited and especially the 10,000 hours thing. That's just silly. If you want to listen to a guy who has crazy hair and glasses, you should listen to James Altucher. What's the 10,000 hours thing? If he said if you want to master something, it takes 10,000 hours of work. Mm. Just random number that he made up. What's, what's funny is I know people, I, I'm thinking of people in particular that have been rated between 1100 and 1200 and they've played tournament chess for 50 years, 50, but they've never gotten to 1200, never, and they never will. And I know another guy who played chess for about 10 years and he got lessons from every, every master and expert in, in Michigan. And he, he said, my goal is to break a thousand, but I know I never will. And I don't think he broke 700 and he played in tournaments for 10 years and he got lessons from everybody. But like 700, that's, that's it. That's, you know, he's not getting better than 700. Truth hurts. Mm -hmm. It took Natalie Merchant 10,000 hours to eat breakfast. Man, it must have been a big breakfast. Hey, can we get the hype train to level four? Do what Karen says. Yay, the truth. The truth hurts. Yeah, I know a guy. For, he lives in Myanmar now because he was born in Myanmar. Thanks, Fen Beingold. We still need a little bit to get to level four. Close. There's a guy in, who's in Michigan. He was a professor at University of Michigan, originally from Myanmar. His USCF rating was 2200, and he knew nothing about chess. No matter what you said, he didn't know what you were talking about. He didn't know anything. He just played chess. He's 2,200. It's good at tactics. Hey, Trojan but Pony. If you said, do you play the King's Indian? He doesn't know what that is. If you asked him about great chess players from the 40s, 50s, and 60s, he hasn't heard of them. He, he didn't know nothing. And when we played in blitz tournaments, he, we would always play four moves of a Slav and then I move four, he would think forever. It's a blitz game. And he usually played a dumb move. Like, it's the same move. Because he just, he, you know, he, he played like chess, and then he's like, okay, that's, I know one or two moves. Doesn't know the, he doesn't know he plays the Slav. But if you hang pieces, he takes them. And he's pretty good at tactics. So he got to 2200, and then uh, his, unfortunately... His daughter, and this is the only person I know who has a relative who died in the 9-11 attacks. His daughter was in the uh, World Trade Center and, and, and passed away. And uh, after that happened, he and his wife broke up. He quit his job being a professor at U of M of physics, and he moved back to Myanmar. Truth hurts. Mm -hmm. I can't see the chat too good. Yeah, hang on one second, I'll bring it back up. Let's see what the chat says.
Neil deGrasse Tyson is terrible at chess. Well, that's not clear. Maybe he's good. Did you guys see that uh, Joe Bava got banned for the rest of the year? Yeah, people were talk talking about that. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. Do you know why we're hearing it? Because I brought up chess.com, and I guess this chess, doc, the chess TV was embedded there. I'm like, what's mm -hmm. going on? Like, why am I hearing myself? Mm -hmm. You guys already talked about it? Yeah, what, what are you doing here? I'm going to add a command that yes. goes to your um, puzzles so that when we do puzzles, I can kind of do the command. You, you drew me? On the right, it says, we, I beat you 22 times and we drew once. Oh, I don't even remember. I remember you drawing me. I don't either. I guess you did. All. What, is it going to lie? Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, 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 you drew me. Good job. I don't remember That's it. impressive. It, you drew a grandmaster. It was probably an axe, you know, probably lost your connection or something. <laughs> well, then you would win. So that, oh, must, that's true. You must have played perfect. Yeah, I don't know what happened. I don't even remember it. Mm -hmm. I think I, yeah, I don't remember it. What did you want to do first tonight? Um, whatever the stream says. Mm -hmm. I think it says blindfold is first. Okay. Let me just find where this is real good. How do I get to your the puzzles? What do you mean get to them? You can get to a history of your puzzles. See where it says games, and then it says puzzles right under it. Yep, well, yep. Yeah, and I just clicked that. No, you click puzzle rush. That. No, 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 no. Yeah, maybe that. Maybe that. Oh. That's, that's what I'm telling you. I clicked that. But can you click the puzzles above oh, I remember, or you can't? I remember now what to do. Mm -hmm. You click the graph, and it goes here, mm. and it's here, down here. Oh, wait, but those are old. Oh, but learning. Yeah, here they are. Mm -hmm. That's going to be hard because this ain't going to take people directly there. All right. Well, they'll have to do like a minute of work. Yeah. All right. Well, that's fine. Mm-hmm. I yeah. understand what you're doing. Right. Let me put the chat up so I can see the chat. Yeah, but you can keep I talking know, to I know me. You, hate you, don't, when I do that. you don't have to talk to me about this. Karen, Joe Bava wasn't banned, just no prize money for 2023. Someone call Mr. Beast. Ben is about to go blind. I don't remember the verbiage. I thought he was banned from chess.com, but maybe it was just from money tournaments. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's what it was. I thought his account was banned. But Go maybe, vegan, what else? You might be right. Maybe it's just from winning money. Ben, say something funny. I had a bad day. Well, you've had a bad day so far, but it's probably going to get worse. And tomorrow's going to be even worse. Truth hurts. But someday you'll have a good day. Tyson was with Tani and Maurice, and he is not more than a 900. What? Oh, you're talking about Neil deGrasse Tyson. I, when you say Tyson, I always think of Mike Tyson. There we go. We try it out when we do the puzzles. Hmm? Oh, okay. I can. Okay, so what's the first thing it says? Blindfold chess. So we'll do that first. Oh, Moose, I'm sure you're right then. I didn't realize you were the one that said that. I know you're more up on it than I am. Um, just no prize money tournaments. Okay, well, that that's still... I think that's fine. So why don't we do 10 minutes so that I can win all the blindfold games? That'll show them. I don't know. It's so long just for one person. Yeah, but that's good. Person. Because we have to give this three-hour stream. Got to kill time. Killed some time. Had some fun. Oh, right, well, five minutes. So challenge me five-minute unrated or 10-minute unrated to play blindfold, and then I'll play you blindfold. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I mean... I'm just saying you just get less people in. Mm -hmm, that's good. Minutes, so. Yeah, because I don't really like people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, so 10-minute unrated. Five-minute unrated. All right, whenever you challenge me, Karen will tell me. I'm cold. Ready? Yeah, let me scoot over here mm -hmm. so I can see better. Yeah, tell me what color I am, and mm -hmm. then tell me the time control, and then tell me the rating. But I don't need to know the time of the game because that doesn't, I, don't, I can't do anything about it. All right. That. Well, okay. You're completely off. I guess there's no way for you to be on. Yeah, I can move over. Okay. Now I'm good. Right? Yeah, we can see. Yeah, we can see. See, I did that. <laughs> All right. Um, <clears throat> how do you do the challenge? 
I think there's a challenge. Don't ask other people how to do stuff. Just do stuff. <laughs> well, the challenge command may or may not have the correct. It has five minutes on rated. That's oh, it does? Yeah. So what do they do? Exclam join? No, that's exclam challenge. Oh, exclam challenge. Exclam challenge. And that should get you there. All right. So we'll just take, um, we'll start out with a five minute and then we'll do a 10 minute. Make sure it's unrated. Yeah, let's see. Unrated, unrated. And then tell me the rating. They're all unrated. So we'll start with five minute unrated rap god 67 rated 10 7 10 77 mm -hmm. five minute unrated game here we go and apologies i think 10 77 is how much a panucci's pizza and, and drink is in futurama all right you're black okay um b3 b6 i wish these things didn't pop up it's real distracting h4 Bishop B7. I hope I didn't just kill the challenges. <laughs> no challenge again. H5. I don't think I did. H6. Oh, we'll figure that after the game. Mm -hmm. Here's challenge Bishop again. B2. Knight F6. Knight F3. B6. E3. Bishop B7. C4. Knight C3. D5 is in David. D4. Knight D2. Knight where? D2. Okay. C5. G4. C takes D4. E takes D4. D takes C4. Bishop takes C4. Bishop takes H1. H1. King E2. Bishop to David 5. Queen G1. Bishop takes C4 check. B takes C4. E5. D takes E5. Knight takes E5. G5. Queen D3 check. King D1. Rook on A8 to D8. Knight 
bishop c1. G takes H6. Uh, knight takes G1. <laughs> I should have played knight F3 before rook D8 because that threatens his queen and mate, and he can't play queen E1 because I take his knight because I take his queen. Now uh, I'm not threatening mate because his bishop's on C1. That I, was my only bad move. I'm, I don't. I can't visualize all the stuff you just said. Yeah. So in this position, when mm -hmm. I played rook a d8, I should play here because that threatens mate and his queen, and he can't play queen e1 because my knight defends that. Oh. But okay. when I played rook d8, and then he played bishop c1, and I went here, I'm not threatening mate. Now I'm up several pieces, and this is hanging, and this is hanging, and this is hanging. Mm -hmm. But still, I can play a little better. I see what you're saying. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't matter because I'm like plus 20 instead of like mate and six or something. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, in the final position, I'm plus, it says 27. It's weird that he took this and not this, but I guess if he takes that, he thought I'd take back, but here he's threatening mate and one. Right. So I guess that's better, because I might, you know, not might have a stroke and not see that he's <laughs> threatening mate and one. Anyway, zero, I always play better blindfold than when I'm looking. It always has a higher number. Yeah. But zero mistakes, zero blunders. I never see that when I'm looking. Mm -hmm. But when I'm playing blindfold, then it's serious. Right. And so forth. Hey, I'm going to grab something upstairs real quick. I'll be right back. And also, can I turn the fan off just because it's probably loud on the stream? They can't hear. Yeah. Are you still cold? Yeah. Because I don't have to. Cold. Okay, let me. The, it says I made zero mistakes and zero Wait, blunders, zero missed wins. Let's see if I played 95 or better. Probably not. But I tried. I played 93.7. Great win. You saw your chance and took it. He played 69.8. Did you guys already talk about Joe Bava? I've talked about Joe Bava on several streams years ago. He likes to dance on stream. Yay, 314 viewers, just like my phone number. Go St. Louis. How high can he go? I mean, that would depend on the quality of, you know, his. Uh... Oh, I was. I thought you were talking about something else. Uh, I. I mean, that again. That question is. That's. I. I can't answer such questions. Those questions have no answers. Those are the kinds of questions you guys like to ask. You should ask questions like, "What's nine times five? And then if I say 45, you can go, wow, like Homer. Yeah, one time outside the tournament hall when the round was over, mm -hmm. I saw Hans smoking weed. And I said, and I said like, w why are you doing that? And he said, don't ask why, ask how high. <laughs> so um, 
there's not much to talk about in this game. Uh, obviously, h4 and h5 is bad, so I'm already better. And then in this position, d4 is very bad because um, he's played h4, h5. He doesn't want the center open. Then that move doesn't make any sense. The point of this move is his queen is like this. Mm -hmm. So he wanted to play g4, which you don't want to play because my bishop's here. Right. But he was yeah. like, Rawr. And if you're going to play g4, you don't want to play d4 and c4 because I'm going to open the center. That's why I played c5. Because mm -hmm. the center is going to get open, and then g4 is like really bad. And your king is here. And since you played h4, h5, it's hard to castle kingside. Because you played h4, h5. So here he's already losing. Then this is a blunder that just loses right away. And then now I'm threatening his rook, which I saw and he didn't see. It's funny that I saw it because I, I couldn't see anything. So it's funny. Okay, and then I thought he wouldn't see his rooks hanging because it's really far. Then he attacked my bishop. He thought he was being all cool. Mm -hmm. And then I wanted to open the e-file. So I thought if we traded some pieces here, then my knight would take, and then my queen and bishop stop g5, and it opens the e-file towards his king. Oh, yeah. So he just played queen g1 to obviously play g5. And um, I played e5 to open the center. And he took, which helps me open the center. And then I ignored his attack because my attack's better because his king is no good. And then, yeah, all his pieces are hanging. Then he threatened mate and one. So he, and then t tell the people at home what it says, the score. I can't see that from here. Minus 50. God mm. damn. That means I'm better. Knight takes G1 is best. Yay. Cool. So, hey, yeah. Tutti, Evangeline. Okay, three minute unrated. God damn, get rid of that. All right. And then don't play Pinfell because he beats me when I'm looking. Although I would beat him blindfold, but yeah. Mm -hmm. But he hasn't donated enough. All right, back to Karen. Yeah, I was just reading the chat. I didn't understand some of it. So mm -hmm. I'll just move on. <laughs> That's good if you don't understand. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. You're fine where you are, but I'm going to hang on to your chair for a second. Just so I can scoot myself. There we go. All right. So you wanted to do a 10 minute one? Whatever. It doesn't matter. So we have a 1549 10 minute or Leorid okay. FGS. Okay. And then let 15, me 49, 10 minutes, fine. shut that window out of my face. All right, here we go. You're black. <clears throat> E4. Uh, E6. D4. D5. E takes d5. Queen takes d5. Uh, knight c3. Bishop d4. Bishop d4. Got it. Queen d3. Knight c6. Knight f3. Knight f6. Bishop d2. Bishop takes c3. Bishop takes. b6, as in Ben. And this is 10 minute? Mm hmm. Okay. Queen B5. Uh, Bishop B7, as in Ben.
<laughs> you guys both have about nine minutes. They just went into the eights. Up. Yeah, I mean, this is why I think five is better. <laughs> Queenside Castle. Uh, okay, Queenside Castle. Bishop C4. Queen takes B5. Bishop takes. Knight E4. Bishop takes c6. Bishop takes c6. Knight e5. Knight takes c3. B takes C3. Bishop E8. Rook H to E1. F6, never play it. Mm -hmm. Get them in play. <laughs> Knight C4. Bishop F7. Knight E3. Rook on H8 to E8. F4. C6. King B2. King C7.
Where's Mr. Fango? Here I am. <laughs> Why is he hiding? Because he's doing blindfold chess. You can see my chair. I'm just facing away from the screen, so I can't see the... Board. Yeah, I agree 10 minutes too long. But, you know, we'll finish this game, and then we're going to not do those anymore. C4. <clears throat> C5. D5. <laughs> don't forget to sub to the channel i don't hear a lot of sub noises Boo. yeah let's get some subs going Boo. and some bits <laughs> some bits yay something happened yay. thank you matt Babic one. Who has more time? Well, you do. They have three twenty eight and counting. You have six forty five. Oh, I have more. That's what I said. Noises. Did I say the wrong thing? No, you, you did good. Oh. What was that noise? Yay! That was a four hundred bit cheer from Xenoid. That was Xenoid. Thank you, Xenoid. Oh, tell me it was Xenoid. I knew it was four hundred. <laughs> oh, I knew it was Xenoid when you said 400. You're studying Japanese, Matt? Oop, or it's Mateo. It's not just Matt, it's Mateo. A4. I figured it out. Mm -hmm. H5. H5, right? F5. What was that noise? I don't know right now. Oh, F5. That good. Um, Let's see. Yay, Big Daddy coming in with a lot more bits than usual. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five hundred. Okay. Thanks, Big Daddy. He takes D5. Yeah, oh, almost did the wrong thing. But I corrected myself. Yay. Who can give you a sub, Mr. Halu? Hey, Ripclaw. <laughs> Not me, says Mosh Pit. Knight takes d5 check. Bishop takes d5. Ooh. 
Rook takes e8. Rook takes e8. Pawn takes on d5. C takes. King to d6. King to d6. Nice little barricader. King C3. Thank you, Big Daddy. Was that you again? Yes, thank you. One, two, four hundred bits. B5. B is in Ben. Did it happen? Mm hmm. I went B5. Oh, right. And they're I'm thinking. Sorry. They have one and a half minutes. You have five and a half. Okay, A takes B5. A takes B5. H3. Um, rook to E3, check. Yay, quadruple digit. Thank you for the 400 bits. You may know it as Myanmar, but it always will be Burma to me. Which show is he referencing? Hang on a minute. Yeah. King B2. As in Ben? Yeah. yeah. What show is he referencing? I don't know. Seinfeld. And I was thinking that when I said the end one. Uh, Rook, excellent five. Always retreat. Thank you for the raid, Ford Todd. Yay. Party with a party of five. Thank you for the raid. Ben's playing blindfold. I'm making the moves for him and calling out the moves for him. C4. B takes C4. King C3. Rook takes D5. Rook takes. King takes D5. Uh, G3. King to D6. King takes C4. King to C6. They resigned. Mm -hmm. They only had 19 seconds left. Yeah. Well, resigning was a good idea. I didn't play so well that game. You can see I didn't play well. Zero mistakes, zero blunders. <laughs> I didn't play well the first 15 moves or so. Mm -hmm. Last 15 moves, I played well. Yeah, this is, yeah, plus 73. Mm -hmm. This is better than my other position where I was up like 10 pieces. Because it already sees I'm going to queen and mate them. So. I'm surprised at depth 34, it's not announcing mate. Huh. I guess mm -hmm. it would be like depth 44. Nicely done. That guy played pretty well. Yeah. Want to explain why I played H5 because it's very uh, uh, educational. Okay. I played 85.3. I'm embarrassed. I wish I could do blindfold. And he played 76.6. Good night, vegan. What else? What else? Double qu I, I didn't take this because I thought bishop c4 trapped my queen. Uh. But, but it says I can take it. I saw queen takes, bishop here, right, and then I gave up. And I still give up. I don't understand what they want me to do there. I can look, but I'm trying to, f I, I didn't see anything I could do. I can't play a6 because he plays queen takes c6 check. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do after bishop c4. Queen a1, he plays king d2. 
Oh, can I play 94 there? That's oh, what I was looking oh at. Oh, my God. I was looking at that. That barely works it. because, well, actually. Can't he just get king e1? Where? Like after. e1? Yeah. Yeah, then I play knight takes c3, and I'm attacking his queen and his rook. And then if he takes, I play queen takes. Yeah, I, I didn't see I could play queen a1, then knight e4. And if I had seen, I saw queen a1. If I had seen that, I probably still wouldn't do it because if I miscalculate, I lose my queen. Mm -hmm. My queen's trapped. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't see 94 check. H5 question mark. What? All right. Well, good night, Vegan. So in, in this position, what I wanted to do was play at G6 so that F5 is covered so that when these pawns get traded, he can't play knight F5. However... I thought h5 was to limit the knight. It is. Oh, if okay. I play g6 now, he plays knight g4, and I don't have a good response right. to that. Yeah. So I played h5 to play g6, which it doesn't like. Hmm. Um, you only had one good move there. Well, thank you. I guess I could just take this and win a pawn. I think that was the idea. I just didn't want to let him play knight f5. But... And then this is bad. This is good. That's best, best, bad. Yeah, plus, yeah, I thought you had to take with the rook, but I thought I'd still be winning after rook e2. Mm -hmm. But now I'm completely, king d6 question mark. That's it's not question mark. That's an excellent move. It wants me to go here probably, but I can do that whenever I want. b5 is excellent. Yeah, this is just wrapping it up. I could play rook e5-1 right away, but I wanted this king to go back first. And then, yeah, okay, it's plus 70 or something. So, mm. yeah, so I was surprised you let him take the pawn. What would you like me to do? I didn't know. I, just, oh. but I'm... I can't move anything else. I have to move my king and let him take this. And I can win by going here. I can win by going here. But I thought it was easiest to win this way because these pawns don't do anything and then I just march up. Okay. It, it, al it, also, it also wins to go here, but there's nothing I can do about this. I just have to decide which way to win. Right. So I decided this way because I thought it was easy to remember and there's nothing you can do. Mm -hmm. I don't think it matters. Yeah. <clears throat> play differently yeah and it, it does announce mate now mate in 29 it's been thinking about it mm. i beat a 2000 elo i'm 1600 elo in a tournament game where we which we both berserked now should i translate that into english um okay first of all it was it was lee chess so you got to subtract like a thousand points and then when somebody says that their opponent was 2,000, that means they were like 1,870. And when they say they were 1,600, that means he's like 1,400, but he thinks he should be 1,600. So you just put that. What's berserk? Berserk is something that happens on Lee Chess. Oh. Where you you double the stakes. Mm -hmm. Or no, you, you, you give your, let's see, what do you do? I forgot what it is because I've never done it. I've never been on Lee Chess. You like get two points instead of one, but you give draw odds and they get more time or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, half your time, twice the points. Uh. Yeah. Anyway, congratulations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it says they both berserked. So it's like four times the points. Now, in over the board play, from 30, 40, 50 years ago, we used to play Contra when you would play Blitz Chess for money. And so that's what, what that does is you're playing Blitz, you say Contra, and now your opponent can resign and the game's over. Or they can agree uh, to Contra, and now you're playing for twice as much money, but they get draw odds. So you're so confident of winning, you double the stakes and give them draw odds. All right. Okay, they can resign. It's it's like a doubling cube in backgammon. And the funniest the funniest story of Contra is Dmitry Gurevich made a move and said Contra because he thought he was winning, and his opponent checkmated him. 
and won. So that, that was the funniest example of somebody contra than mate. That wasn't a good contra. Mm. Yeah. Cold. Contra, nice word. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we'll do hand and brain. I only know about the contras in the 80s. The arms. Mm -hmm. With whichever country it was. So we'll, we'll do Reagan. hand and brain and we can keep the challenges there. We're still doing five minute unrated. Sure, the contra scandal. What are we doing next? Hand and brain. Um, yeah, that's fine. I bet 20 subs for a training match. I lose, I give 20 subs. Uh, and I need training. I'm 1,400. Yeah, if you give the 20 subs in advance. That's right, Nicaragua. I'm not going to play you, but thanks for the 20 subs. So I thank you in advance for the 20 subs. Yeah, I don't remember all the deets, but yeah, it was mm -hmm. Nicaragua. Or Iran was somehow in the mix. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the Iran-Contra affair. Right. And SNL did a great skit where the only person who understood what was going on was Reagan. He was yelling at all of his subordinates, you do this and you do that. <laughs> then somebody calls from China and he's speaking in Chinese. And then he says, Mr. President, you're going too fast. I don't understand. And you don't have to understand. Only I understand. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, let's get it going. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, if you want to donate subs, thank you. But that's the extent of, you know. You like we, Nicaragua? We, we don't get blackmailed on our stream unless we have the black pieces. All right. And also, you're obviously a cheater. Terrible. Okay. So let's get rid of this. Yeah, who played Reagan on Saturday Night Live? Uh, Phil Hartman. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. R.I.P. R.I.P. Yeah. All right. And your band. But I'll take 25 subs. Man, we had 1,200 subs yesterday. Now we have 1096. Terrible. So what are we going to... Who are we going to play? Whoever you want to play. Let's play this guy. He's first. That's fine. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. We're white. Oh, we did it. Rap God already. Pawn. But we'll let him in again. Bishop. Pawn. Knight. Bishop. Pawn. Knight. Pawn. Queen. Yay! King. Sephora at the FFCC gave 20 subs. What move? King. King. Okay. That guy who said he was going to give me 20 subs gave me 20 subs. Great. That's crazy. I guess we should play him at some point. That's good bribing. Um, let's see. King. Always play King B1. Knight. Oh, knight. That's good bribery. Don't let that guy talk you out of donating 21 subs, whoever you are. Um. Yay. Bishop. That's some thumping. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Delicious. Night. Come on, someone raises 20. You have to give at least 40 subs to raise them. You have to double them. 
It's to be a raise. Otherwise, it's not a legitimate raise. You can call too. But don't fold. Pawn. Are you the only vegan GM? No, I would probably think there's 40 or 50 vegan GMs, if I had to guess. Um, rook. Uh-huh. Two knight. Give me the knight. Night. That doesn't seem like a lot. There's about 1,700 GMs. So it's Pond. not a lot of vegan ones. What'd you say? Pond. Mm hmm. The GMs from India do not have to be vegetarian, but probably some of them are. Pawn. Bishop. I've never played Raven Sturt. Queen. Bishop. She's definitely not a vegan. <laughs> Rook. Even when he was a vegetarian, he wasn't a vegetarian. Uh, let's see, whose turn is it? It's hot in here. Want some Perrier? We and Vish used to be like that, son. Now we're more like that. It was pretty far away. Let's see. Rook. I didn't say that. Bishop. This guy's good for 1077. Plays better than most of my opponents. Um, Rook. Never play F3. Um, pawn. The rising stars, they don't promise me nothing. Bishop. Rook. 
queen. Rook. It's hard for me to catch my heart. Queen. King. Stop the game. It's too exciting. King. Queen. I didn't see that. Yeah. I, I saw like so many mates. I looked at it. I saw so many Rook. mates, but I didn't see that one. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> there were so many checkmates. <laughs> we had checkmate earlier, too. Oh, sorry. But, but yeah, like in this position, mm -hmm. I was like, this mates, this mates, and bishop f5 mates. But you say queen, I'm like, where does she want to go to the queen? And I was like, oh, here. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. bishop f5 is annoying because... And yeah. Queen H7, and then this way, and then when you said queen here in this position, in yeah. this position, yeah, you just, just rook takes h6. If he takes with the bishop, queen h7's oh, mate. Oh, yeah, yeah. If he plays king here, queen h7's mate. So that's just mate and two. Mm -hmm. And I was like, okay, this is safe because my king can run out here. Yeah, I was looking to get again queen g7, yeah. obviously. But I looked, it took a long time because I was trying to figure out if the king could escape. Yeah, that's the mate I didn't see. Yeah. Yeah, we're too good. And I did think that, you know, the king could escape. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I mean. We played 64.9 and he played 59. We made nine blunders. Nine. Most of the blunders were my fault. Like, you said pawn and I played h4. That's bad. Then you said king and I castle queen side. That's bad. Here you here in this position you should defend this with the rook. The F pawn. Yeah. This, this move you could just ruin our pawn structure. I thought about it, but you're always yelling, "Oh, you're too passive." So, mm -hmm. which it's still passive to move the bishop, but um, I was hoping he would take what she did. I guess that was wrong. Every move a wonder. It's good. <laughs> it is. Every <laughs> move is the worst. Not the best game. <laughs> yeah, he should play knight e3 here. Yeah, here he made a really bad move. It's funny that it's f3 because, you know, black playing f3 is fine, but f3 is, you know, not a good move. Right. He went from winning to, like, lost. No. Yeah. Yeah, now he's just lost because we have a mating attack and he doesn't. Queen mm -hmm. d3 blunder. Yeah, it, wa it wanted us to just play here. Yeah, I think or, I did or, next or move. Or this rook here and then double up. I think I did next move. But didn't like it next move. Oh, because it is. I don't know. <laughs> it wants me to take this. this dumb. Stupid computer. Yeah, we had the mate there, but this is winning. Yeah, I mean, it was a similar idea what my mate was. Amazing. I just didn't that see That move it. is not easy to find. And also, I was really worried about the time, mm -hmm. so I was trying to hurry. Yeah, we did good. So, w w the guy who gave me 20 subs, if you want to play me a game, then challenge me. If you're still here. Thank you, pushing. I, I don't know what your name is on chess.com. So, like, challenge me somehow. Don't ask me how, and then, and then uh, tell me your you know what's happening. Well, thank you, Derek. Also, who are you? 
Who was the guy who gave me 20 subs? Thanks. Um, I don't know. I wasn't looking at he, He's He's some rich billionaire. <laughs> That's going to give us all his money. Hey, here it is. I still can't remember that name. It's too long. Sephiroth, FFCC. <laughs> Thank you, Sephiroth. I hope that Sephiroth was proper, properly thanked. Mm hmm. Yeah, you give 20 subs. Yeah, that was the greatest game ever played, basically, the last <laughs> one, because there's all kinds of stuff was happening. It was too exciting. <laughs> That's your this is your first time pushing ink. Well, let me see where where yeah, we more are. hand and brain because he's not answering. Ready? Yeah, if he pops back up, he can jump mm -hmm. in. This could be him. Who knows? Yay, Lior ACDF! Thanks for gifting a sub. Wait, why is it not starting? He didn't move yet. It says waiting or mm -hmm. auto abort. Mm -hmm. Usually I thought the time would start. No, but... they don't start until you move, like in Lee Chess. Oh, that's right. Well, no, I thought it did, though. I thought it did. Mm -hmm. It does, usually. Maybe they changed it. Mm-hmm. I don't know, there have been server issues, but... Do you want to abort? Yes. Okay, ready? We'll lose to Pinfelt. Sorry, jokes. Send another one. Okay, Pinfelt. Let's beat him, like, in, you know, cahoots. Didn't Pinfelt beat win recently? Yeah, you or have he? to say something. Oh, sorry. Pawn. Um, yeah, he beat me the last game I played. Uh, night. How do gifted subs work? You give subs and then I have them. Yay. Um, pawn. Bishop. Bishop. Knight. Bishop. King. It's Pondemonium. Yep, I did play Blindfold yet. Now we're doing Hand and Brain. And then, puzzle time. Night. Pawn. Archer said when we do puzzles, he'll come down. Oh, okay. Yeah, he mentioned that to me that he mm -hmm. might jump in on it. Mm -hmm. Pawn. Ah, 
sorry. Uh, queen. Always sack the exchange. Yeah. Knight. Rook. Queen. Mm. Queen. I would change it, but I can't. <laughs> Night. He's back again. Who is he? Who? Huh? I don't know. He says he's back again. It's maybe he's shady. I don't know. Pawn. Guess who's back? Tell my friend. Rook. Bishop. Night. Oh darn. Sorry. I didn't see it. Yeah, I think we have to resign. Yeah, sorry, I didn't see it. I can play knight here and knight here, but he takes the queen and takes the rook. And he's yeah. threatening this and this. Yeah. Sorry about that. 
What's the archer's rating? He's like 1,700-ish U.S. chess. Oh, darn. Sorry about that blunder. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he blundered first. I'm giving his rook away. Yeah, I wasn't sure mm -hmm. if if that was a blunder or if there was some... No, he just did see bishop takes. Oh. Yeah, and he, he may have thought insanely that he could do this and didn't see that we have queen f8. I don't know if that's what he missed or he just didn't see bishop takes. And his tactic works if you take with the queen. If you play this, mm -hmm. then he checks and then takes this and the bishop's pinned. But you took with the bishop, so and yeah. just, then he just loses a rook. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, if I go here now to defend my queen, he trades queens and takes the rook, and now he's threatening this and this. So we're just losing. And and if I play here, then then our our bishop's pin. So bishop a three is happening and takes. Yeah, I know. It's a bad so move. we're just yeah. It's I unfortunate. Understand. Well, sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm lower rated. I'm not sure what you're expecting. I'm just analyzing for the chat. Okay. Okay, so this is all good. This is all good. Good. This is all good. If pin fails there, he could say what he had. Oh, you got lucky. You didn't know the bishop can take a3. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. B4 is a mistake because of C4. So here we have to, like, probably play queen d7 or queen e8 and defend our pawn. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, it's he's slightly better. c4 is a good move. Then the problem is he's threatening c5. So we have to, it, the engine wants me to play bishop c7 or knight c8. Then I'm just we're worse because c5's coming. I saw c5, but oh, I just yeah. didn't. I'd forgotten about the long diagonal. When you said pawn, I wanted to like make a lift or go here, but c5 wins a piece. So I had to sack the exchange. Always sack the exchange. Mm -hmm. This isn't too terrible. Yeah, we want to put our knight here, and we want to get luft, and we want to push our pawns. When you said rook, I assume you wanted to play rook c8. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, then queen b5, and this pawn is uh, not easy to defend. So I just stopped queen b5 with this, because I wanted to push the pawns anyway. So I wanted my rook here, so I could keep pushing. Right. And then you said queen. I assume you wanted me to go here. I didn't think about it. I was just hanging the pawn. Until no, this doesn't it. hang. This is fine. But I didn't want to over put there, my queen. Over there, but I wasn't thinking about it over there. Yeah, I didn't want to put my queen here because I wanted to put my knight here. Mm -hmm. So I just played this and then still want to play knight here. And then we did. Yeah, queen, queen f1, queen g2 is crazy. That's like terrible square for the queen. Queen's much better like around here. Mm -hmm. So we have compensation because we have a passed pawn coming. Yeah, he should play b3, so we can't get a pass pawn right away. Right, yeah. So, yeah, here the engine says, like, he's slightly better, because, I mean, this isn't that bad, this position. Yeah, now it says black's better. Yeah. And then, yeah, rook b2's fine. I wanted to get left, but rook b2's fine, and he blundered. And then, yeah, just rook, I mean, just rook moves away, like rook here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. Rook takes f2 is a good move. I didn't see that because it attacks his rook. Sacking the exchange is good. You got the light squares. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had a nice knight on d5. This reminds me of another game we played. We had a nice knight on d5. We were pushing our pawns. Yeah, I remember that. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Let's see who played better because neither one of us played great, but we might have played better. Doubt it. Yeah, we played better than him. Mm -hmm. Eighty-five point seven. He played seventy-seven point seven. But he played more sevens than us. Good game though, pin fail. The reason we played better mm -hmm. is because you said knight, and then I resigned. Yeah. If so, it doesn't know. It, we're winning in the final position. It doesn't know that you said knight. Oh yeah. So it thinks like <laughs> that we played great and that we're winning in the final position. <laughs> That's fun. We made no blunders. That's true. That's now, true. Pinfell should be ashamed for one reason, and for one reason only. Mm -hmm. In all the moves that were played, he played three best moves. Three. Yeah, come on. Like a 700-move game. 
And Pitfield did good. Terrible. Yeah, but look at all the double questions. Except for that one blunder. Oh, he made three blunders. Every move he made was a blunder. Except C4, that was good. The worst was, yeah, that was good. So where are we at with the string and the puzzles? We uh, should start doing puzzles in about 15 minutes. We can start early if you want to do puzzles. No. So we just, just do more puzzles. I'm just trying to keep track of it. I wanted to do an hour of each, but we could do more puzzles. That's no fine. Let's just pas stick with the plan. <laughs> Did you two match on purpose? So good. Hey, see Poker P. Pinfell beats me every game. Boo, boo. <laughs> and he doesn't even give him like 50 subs or anything. <laughs> okay, ready? Yeah. Pawn. Yay, 100 bits. Thanks, Wes. It feels like I beat you the last three games. No, Mike Sailor subscribed. Hey, Mike. Yay, we're close to a hype train. I do look good, thank you. Some say Karen looks good, but it's hard to compete with me. Cold. And you're hot? I feel like I'm drinking Perrier. Um, I feel, I'm feel i not hot anymore. We're playing great cold. this game. 100%. All right, well, he's gone. Oh, there we go. Um, Bishop. Yeah, they changed the behavior of the clocks. Mm hmm It's kind of strange. Pawn. Go hype train. Somebody start the train. Do it. Mm. Nine. Mm-hmm. Um, Bishop. Pawn. King. Knight. Oh, give me the knight. Yeah, my opponent put it in H. And your opponent did. Pawn. Go hype train. Let's get it started. Let's hype it up. Bishop. Yay, thanks, Fem Beingold, for 500 bits starting the train. Bishop. You're the best. 475 viewers. What else? Go hype train. Bishop. Bishop. Go hype train. Come on, people, let's go. Let's go hype train. Pawn. Um, 
Kirche. Go on, people. Hype train. Let's go. Hype train. 500 viewers. What else? Well. Let's go hype train. Come on, people. We need a thousand subs quick. Same thing yet. Pawn. Queen. Pawn. Queen, King, King. Sorry. <laughs> King. King. Um, Rook. Rook. King, Rook, King, King, 
I should put, I guess, read on. <laughs> I guess. Oops, you know, plays F6 and F5. It's weird, like how well he plays, but how he has no understanding of chess. Oh. But he, I mean, you know, it's just, it's. Just, well, we hung a piece. No, I mean, it just seems like there's something weird going on because his rating is so low, but some of his moves are like lower than his rating, and some of them are like you know good. So uh, we were losing because of me. So like in this position, uh, like we're doing fine here, and then when I, when when you said bishop, I should just move this bishop. I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna do anything. I was gonna like take and play here because we're all blocked. This this is a good defense. Mm -hmm. And when you said bishop, I guess the best move a bishop move is bishop to d three, um, because basically we want to ignore black here because black doesn't have anything he can do. So we want to play like queen b three and attack this and this and mm -hmm. put pressure everywhere. And then we said bishop. I thought this was safe, but that's insane. So like that's a terrible move. Yeah, because yeah. they get to come in. And then here, we're still okay. We need to play queen f3 so that we can take this. And then if he does something about it, we can just save our bishop and our queen's defending. And c takes is okay, too, attacking his knight. Wait, how do we save the bishop? Well, we do other stuff. Like, we take this, threatening the knight. And then queen f3 threatens this. So... Queen of three, they take the bishop, then... Right, then we take, take, and then we're down a piece, but his king's here and his rook's here. Right, okay. So that's about equal. Uh, thanks, um... Potentials. BK Emeritus for rating with a party of one. Yay, thank you, BK Yeah, now we're, just, now we're just dead. And then in this position, like, we definitely want to take this. Um, and try to get some material back. Mm-hmm. And then, yeah, I mean, here we're just dead. Yeah, here you want to play knight e4. Although, engine says, like, it's plus 5,000. So I, I don't know why. Oh, I mean, I don't like it. Oh, I know why. The pawn takes. I, I know why. Because yeah. if he, he plays queen takes f3, and we can't stop rook h1 mate and queen h1 mate. Yeah, oh. and he has mate here next move. Oh. Like, no matter what we do. Yeah, and then here he shouldn't trade queens. Like, queen h6 is good, and we have unstoppable mate. So, I mean, it doesn't matter. We're losing. Mm -hmm. He kept trying to mate us, and we kept stopping it. <laughs> good game. I'm not sure how to say the name. Lorid FGS. Good game. Hooray. Good game. Very suspicious. Thanks, Fen buying gold for 200 bits. I believe in you, Lorid. You'll be back in 35 minutes, Fen buying gold. All right, see you. Thank you for the 200 bits. It was weird in this position. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I hate losing to people when they play F6 and then F5. Yeah. Little kids do that. Okay, so in this position, here after this, like he thought like... 20 seconds on that. Damn. It's a lot of time to think when you have 55 to 35 seconds. See, it looks like he has unstoppable mate. Like here, like in this position, he's threatening rook here mate. So then we stopped it. Then he threatened mate again with b4. Mm -hmm. And you said pawn. And That's then sad. he doesn't have mate, so he thought forever. And then he took everything. Yeah. I thought we were going to win even here. <laughs> you know, I mean, it was... Over. Boo. Anyway, you're banned. <laughs> Good night, Derek. 98. Have a nice evening. Yeah, we didn't play well that game, but mainly it was me. Well, I mean, I hung a piece. You hung a piece? Yeah. When did you hang a piece? 
Pretty sure I did. I mean, when you hung a piece, it was plus a thousand. That didn't matter. We were losing because of me. Uh, Seventy six point eight, and he played eighty four point five. How's he playing eighty four point five? He's thirteen hundred. He should play like four point five. <laughs> well, I probably said the wrong pieces. He played G four is not really brilliant. Knight G three is not. It says these moves are brilliant, but they're just like the most obvious move. Yeah, it says he should be banned because he and, and and not only that, you know, people who don't know how to promote their pawns when they're queening them, like F six then F five. The worst thing is it's F six. That's the worst. Yeah. It could have been like H six eight, but it was F six. Never play F six. It was a mouse slip, and also they were in time, time trouble. No. They were. Never been so mad. I start panicking when I'm in time trouble. BK thank Emeritus you. gifted five subs. BK Emeritus, thank you. Anyway, well done. Good job, Lord. Yeah, but mainly it was me to blame because you would say a piece and then I would make a terrible move. Well, I'm, I'm sure I missed stuff. But All right, time for puzzles. Nothing I can do. There is stuff that. you could do. Study more poker. <laughs> And I will. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, we lost every game. We're the worst. My phone died, so can you text him as I can even text him? Oh, yeah, I forgot about Archer. So we're going to do puzzles next. What's Archer's name? Archer. Oh, it was a misclick or a mistake. <laughs> Don't forget your band. I've had trouble with you before. Whoa, what happened? Java Bandit gave 25 Yay, subs. Java you, think, you think he's a friend of Joe Bava's? <laughs> I hope so. All the same consonants in Java. He crushed that guy who gave 20 subs and then left when I was about to play him a game. Mm -hmm. Yay, Java Bandit. Yay, thank you, Java Bandit. So let me see if my new... Now, normally I would like your handle and I like your subs... But if it's a lit, if it's literal and you steal coffee, come on, I need coffee. Did you text him? Yeah. So I have this command that may or may not be helpful. <coughs> Excuse so me. So if, if people want to go back even during the stream or later and look at the puzzles we did, I think you can get to them. Oh, I've never been this cold in my life. Damn. See if the command worked. It, it didn't, didn't work. It did not work. P U Z Z. Why didn't it work? We have a lot of commands. Yeah. Well, I deleted them one time and everybody was upset with me. I deleted a whole, I went crazy and started deleting. Just okay, that's a bunch. It doesn't exist. I added it. She might have called it something else. <sighs> Can you do it by how many, like the most recent? I don't know. Let me see. Why did it say? I don't know. I think it's still in the buffer. It is. Message, yeah. I don't know unless it's full. There it is. I see it. Where do you see it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, so you did good. All right. Now well, it'll work. <laughs> I mean, no, people have asked before. They want to they wanna spend more time on a puzzle. So, you, you know, you can do that. And I'll post the, the link again. The, the problem with that command is nobody can spell puzzle review who's in the chat. I'll do it for them. Everyone right, but I mean, if they ever want to do it, they, they can't do it. It takes you to puzzles. Yeah, you know what? When you get... Yeah, there they are. You just have to click on the learning tab. Scroll down and click on the learning tab. And there you'll see the unrated puzzles. Let's see what Archer said. I'm doing some work, but I'll be down in a sec. He's doing mm -hmm. work. I know. Put that in here. Scroll down. say it all right well let's get going we don't have to wait on him we have to wait it doesn't work 
It should work. It worked for me. No, 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 no stop. He's kidding. Uh, Look what he wrote. Oh. Uh, he wrote Butzel Review. Oh. <laughs> you know, he's, he's, you know, he, don't ever believe anybody in the chat about anything. Next right. thing, you'll, next thing, they'll be saying things like there was an earthquake, at, you know, the border of Turkey and Syria, and the thousands were killed. Ridiculous. You, they'll say things like it was 108 degrees below zero in the U.S. I can't believe what they're saying. Ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm ready. All right. <clears throat> it's Archer. How's it going? Fine. This is our first puzzle. And we're just sitting here staring at it, yeah. confused. So, yeah. if you haven't missed a thing, hope. <clears throat> yeah. Some guy gave 25 subs, so it's making a lot of noise. <laughs> it was like five minutes ago. Yeah. Aha! Now I have the right answer. I guarantee it. We could still get to 1,200 subs if we have a couple more crazy you know, donors. Make sure you're crazy before you give a lot of subs. I think I have the answer. I know I have the answer. Yeah. The chat answers are shallow and pedantic. You're not watching XQC do Hogwarts Legacy? What's Hogwarts Legacy? You're a kid. I don't know. What? It's Hafu's doing Hearthstone. Mira's doing Grand Theft Auto 5. London has five viewers? Wow. Seems like that should be the move. There. There. Most of the chat is banned for their answers. And then there. Take. Grey Knight gifted me a sub to Chess... Oh, gifted you a sub to Chess Bra. Oh, really? Yeah. Thank you. I was like, that's, that's your tab. I do. Did you do your work? Thanks. Thank you yeah. so much. Yeah, the answer is fries. That is mm -hmm. correct. The answer is fries. Do you use that in school a lot when the teacher asks what the answer is? Do you say the answer is fries? Yeah. Good. Now, according to your mom, uh, a lot of people who run your school and yeah. or teach like the adults are Turkish. Yeah. And then you heard what happened. Yeah. Yeah. So that means they probably know somebody who was injured. Terrible. Anybody from Syria at your school? Probably, but mm. maybe not a teacher. Mm. Probably a student. Darn, this is hard mm -hmm. to me. I remember this puzzle Ginger GM was doing and he solved it immediately. Oh, wait, I could do that check. Let's see. Check. And then you just go up. Oh, but then that's mate. Okay, I think it's B4. 
Name an American grandmaster born in Syria. Yeah. Yasser Sarawan. Oh. He moved to England when he was a baby. Then he moved to Seattle when he was a little kid. And then, uh, yeah, rookie one. Mm-mm. Oh. Uh, then B three check. King takes. Oh, uh, check, and this is hanging. Oh, okay. But B three. Yeah. B three. That's why I said Ginger GM solved it. You got to be free. Oh, how about And then Pinfell found a really good defense for White, mm -hmm. indicating you know a little suspicious. <laughs> you know, because nobody would find why, this defense. What? What you defense? know, everybody that streams is I... Okay. So he, he look at look at this defense he found. All right. Oh, okay, now that's not a defense. Pinfell found rook this defense, rook here, threatening the pawn with check. Mm -hmm. Then we have to play C five, then we continue with our plan, which is Pinfell's defense is better than the computer's defense. Um yeah, rookie one. Mm-hmm. And King takes. Twenty nine thirty one. Darn, I almost got it. I missed one Pinfell's move. Pinfell's too good. Darn. I Does Karen have a it. title? Yeah, her title is the best wife. <laughs> no, I'm not very good. No titles. I'm hoping to get some titles, although they don't really have titles, but do some poker. with my new women's study group. So now tell me again, so I'm in this new puzzle group with a chess player, Victoria Livshits. You said puzzle group? I mean, poker I mean group. a poker group, poker yeah. group. Mm -hmm. Victoria Livshits. It's not funny. It's, I've heard the word, I've heard the name Livshits my whole life. It's like you've never heard that name. So now tell me how you know her. Is she old? old? She's, She's a, younger she, than you? No. She's your age. She's probably older. She might be my age. She she had because she was married. Right. She, her kids. husband was twenty four hundred. She's about twenty one fifty, and her daughter. They didn't play chess in the U S. They they don't play, and her daughter was playing. So they would take her to the tournaments. Oh. And her daughter was like good when she was five. Then when she was like eleven or twelve, she was two thousand ish, and then she stopped playing chess when she was like fourteen. Oh, okay. So Victoria wasn't playing anymore at that point. She might have played one tournament that I saw, but I don't know. Maybe maybe I imagine. So okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, she's pretty good at poker, anyway. Mm -hmm. And the name, you know, is funny to me. Live shits. Victoria Live shits. Good yeah. poker player. Not, not spelled very well by Bonarici. <laughs> Several mistakes. Anyway, she's really nice and good at poker, and I'm in her study group now, so I'm gonna get good at poker. Ready? Yeah. That was 2931. I almost had it. I messed up. I should have gone slower. Mm. Mm. I feel like I almost had it. I just needed to mm -hmm. go slower. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. <sighs> I have solved it. Check. I'm the best. Uh, what do we do? If I go there. Can't go there. To go there and there. When I moved to St. Louis, one of their supermarket chains is Schnucks. And I just thought that was the stupidest thing ever. Then after like six months, I got used to it. And now it's not stupid anymore. It is stupid, but I don't care anymore. So it, it, it was a really stupid name for a grocery store. But so it's not funny to me anymore. Queen's... Queen C6. Uh -huh. Check. Okay. And then who wasn't sure? Probably Rook. Let me see. Did you get it and you're bored? Yeah. Okay. D7, maybe. Can somebody do a wellness check on Leo or ACDF? <laughs> well, are you okay? And I think it's just. Uh, King F, King F. Jesus Christ. Rook D7. Everything capitalized. Yeah, Rook D7's right. Because you don't want him to run mm -hmm. off. Mm hmm. And then let me see which one I want to do. It's like some animal ran onto Leo or ACDF's like laptop and started pushing buttons. Queen lawnmower. What? 
Now they just rook d8. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 2910. Because if you move mm -hmm. the queen back, then they're going to go queen e8. What would you do on the king here? Uh, king there. Yeah, uh, rook e8. Uh -huh. Very good. The three by three square with the rook and the queen is a mm -hmm. classic pattern. <laughs> okay, next. First of all, what opening is this? Um, if you don't, you don't know. But I'm going to ask Archer. If you don't know your band, let's see. Let's e four. It's really obvious what opening it is from the pawn where everything is. Yeah, I mean, I don't really. All right, you. Oh. oh. Like every piece on the board tells you what opening it is. Like this does, this does, this does, this does, this does, this does, this, this, this. Well, I'm not good with openings. Yeah. But after I do your chessboard course, I'll be great at openings. And except for this one, looks like an E4. Right. The correct answer is Sicilian Shreshnikov. Oh. French. Yeah, I wasn't going to get Two that. Two people said French? Jesus Christ. Well, it's because of this. The pawns are backwards. Though. You're, you're all banned. Cause banned the, um, on the run. The pawns in the center. You're all banned on the run. County judge. All right, let me look. White jury. Let's see. This is a puzzle? Oh, okay. I see. Uh, all right. I got to look at it. It can't be a knight or if it's a Sveshnikov Sicilian. Then I Every be. piece on the board is screaming Sveshnikov Sicilian. I mean, it's just 97. Just 97? Huh. What okay. do you mean? Then bishop takes. Well, then I have out queen. Queen takes g4. Yeah, and then pawn takes knight. Oh, I didn't see that. Uh, yeah, but if you didn't see pawn takes knight, why didn't you just take this on move one? Why'd you throw that in? Oh, that's a good point. You just thought it was easy. These are all 3,000 lately for some no, reason. I don't know I why. I didn't think it was easy. There, every every puzzle is 2,900, 3,000 like every day. I'll go ahead since I already messed it up. Archer? Well, no. He takes you. Yeah, you just take all the pieces. Take the pieces. Yeah, just take them. And take this one. And take this one. Just never stop taking pieces. <laughs> yeah. Twenty-three fifty. All right. Well, that one wasn't so hard. I needed to give it more time. Maximus Payne explains it's a French because the pawns are on d6 and e5. And I haven't banned him from the stream. See? And I'm the bad guy. Karen? He says people say it's the French because of these pawns. We already here. talked about it a while ago. I said it's misled. It's the pawns are backwards. You know, no, no, but this, that's the French. What? I'm just saying I can see why they're saying that because it was a pawn on e4 and if they don't play the french it's got the two mm -hmm. connected pawns even though they're on the wrong squares exactly i'm just saying i understand why they're saying that i play the french but you guys are all banned well, i have to ban karen and archer too just so we like, don't all it know it doesn't look like i'm taking favorites we don't know here. all the openings i know that one because i play the french Well, the pawns aren't correct. Man, when you said you couldn't spell Shreshnikov, you weren't kidding. God damn. Mm -hmm. Still better than expected. You know who Bonarici reminds me of the way he the way he talks? Mm -hmm. Like his his style? Is uh who's is Alan Kessler? I think they're the same age too. Because Alan Kessler can't spell or doesn't know anything either, so it's funny. I, they don't seem the same to me. I think though. they're the same person. Uh, are you Alan Kessler? I mean, I know who it is. Ready? Yeah. All right. Band on the run. I mean, that has to be the answer. So, all right. Alan Kessler's way smarter than me? How do you know who that is? Who said that? Have you, uh, oh. Bonnery, you're wrong because you don't know what Alan Kessler eats. If you knew what he ate, you wouldn't say he's smarter than anybody. I met Alan Kessler in at Harrah's um, at a tournament, poker tournament. His taste in food is that of a five-year-old. 
So if you like, what does my five-year-old like to eat? That's him. So imagine you took a five-year-old to a fancy restaurant and they're like, can I get a hot dog and can I get ketchup and can I get fries? And that's, that's Alan Kessler. Exactly Alan Kessler. Well, it seems like he has to G take H4. Right. What's funny is when he goes to a nice restaurant, he, he takes a picture of the menu, puts it on Twitter and says, there's nothing here I can eat. Like the whole menu, because he only eats like hot dog, hamburger, you know. Yeah. Okay. The latest thing he posted was he ordered a Philly cheesesteak with nothing on it. So it's not a Philly cheesesteak. It's the steak. H3. And, and then bread. And then he wanted double steak. So they wanted to charge him for two Philly cheesesteaks. So he argued with them for like 10 minutes, the manager and the person taking his order. And they finally said, okay, fine. The chef wanted to double charge him too. I see, man. What is a cheesesteak? You're banned. Yeah, that's right, Ted Bradley. Yeah, that's what he eats. I guess he's uh, King takes D five and King E4. Mm-hmm. Bonarici's answer is illegal <laughs> and bad. Like, it's illegal, and then it's not a good answer. Usually, it's just illegal, like as a typo. But he has a typo, King, then he has the wrong answer, too. King takes F4. Mm-hmm. 2410. That one wasn't that one. Yeah, Bonarici's one. banned because of his H2. King G. H2? What kind of move is H2? What, when did he just say? Okay, first of all, he said king takes d3. So he meant king takes d5. Type then in five. this position, he said h2. And then after takes, king here, he said, I'm done. I've never been so mad. And then king here and draw. Except probably black's winning. But it has to be a draw because w- otherwise that would be another answer. Yeah. I think Surpri- I'm surprised have- that's a draw. Let me look at that. That's interesting. His wrong answer is interesting. Mm-hmm. H2. Whoa. And then, oh, is this a draw? No. So he has to go here. Okay. Ah. You pre-move F5. Pre-move. So if he plays D6 or D5, F5 draws. Oh. You have to pre-move it. Then he plays here, the pre-move doesn't work, because it like, doesn't matter. Yeah, against either move, F, I think F5 is the only move that draws. Oh, no, King G4 draws, because we can try to queen also. Right, I thought. So he has to play King here, and then, and then... Oh, King G2 also draws, because if he takes, you go here. Mm. But, okay, F5 is easy draw. I mean, the people in the chat would still lose. Okay, good job, good job. Bye, Will Owens. No, you can't leave. Will Owens. Twenty four ten. Bye, bye, everyone. Oh, we're sorry you have to go. Hey, I'm the goat. He says. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Not bad. Ready? Yeah. Hey, this is like a Karen kind of puzzle. <laughs> Uh, I don't see why two answers don't work. So that means my answer's wrong. What What are your two answers? I only see one answer. Well, that's what I'm saying. Well, what, what's your other answer? I'm not going to say my answers until I think it's right. <laughs> I reason, just told you I have two answers. The reason she thinks there's two answers is because she follows the rule never play F3. Yeah. So since white can't play F3, there's lots of answers. 
So she's right. I mean, obviously my answer is wrong. That's what I just said. Yeah. Your answer is probably right. Let me try this out. Let's see. Check there. Okay. Well, I'm not sure. It seems like Rook G6. Right. And not only that, but... everybody in the chat is explaining how White's going to play King H1. Mm -hmm. So I think here's what's going to happen. Here's, I don't, here's, here's I'd rather I try to solve it. No, no, no. I think you don't have to solve it. I think after <laughs> this, it's either going to end. Yeah. Or they're going to play Bishop here. And when you take it, it's going to end. I don't think it's going to play King H1. All right, well, let's just I don't see. think it's going to happen. And when I say I don't think it's going to happen, I know it's not going to happen. Oh, no, no. It's going to play bishop g5. Then it's going to play king h1. It's definitely going to play bishop g5. I guarantee that. that guarantee, extend, guaranteed. Extend the life. All right, well, There's another just, reason, but yeah. All right, just take it. Uh-huh. Um, dun, 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 dun. Yeah, okay, so there's more to this puzzle than I expected. Still not too much. Let's see, check there. Yeah, but you're bad at shogi too. Oh, snap! XQC has 99,000 viewers for Hogwarts Legacy. Yeah. Now, London has twice as many viewers as usual, too. No, nothing. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to spend Terry on. Let me see. There's a mate. Vangelin, less typing and more donating. Nobody cares what you write in the chat, but if you give a sub, then we won't ban you forever. We'll ban you for a month or two, but not forever. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm not sure of all the moves. Okay. Bishop G2? Yeah. You know why it's Bishop G2 and it's not B6 check or B5 check? Well, I see the pawn can block. There's a better move, and that's why he gave his bishop away. Queen D5. Yeah, he's Queen D5 check. Oh, I didn't see that. that. But that's because the bishop was here. Right. That's That's why he played here. He was tempting you to do this. Okay. Yeah, I didn't see that. Yeah, actually. and by the way, if this did win, if there wasn't a Queen D5, mm -hmm. then this would also win. That's what I said. Right. So that so that's why you have to go here. <laughs> I said I had two moves, and that mean it wasn't. No, right. but rig G, no, rig G six. Yeah. Oh, I got it. That part. Yeah. I feel like twenty seven ten. <laughs> we said there's two ways to win. That insinuates, you mean like I now? I said that I had two moves, therefore they were wrong because I didn't see a difference between B six and B five. Right. Because you saying. didn't see F three. At first I didn't, but then I did see ah, it. Because you never play F3, so you're sort of right. And then when I'm... Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Did, did everybody get banned? Okay, good. Ready? Yeah. And then just a reminder, if anybody wants to look at these puzzles some more. What is it? I think that's it. Good job. Go there and then click on the learning tab. Oh, I even have it in there. Okay, ready? Spit. Uh, let's see here. Carry the one. <clears throat> band on the one. Everybody's band. Huh. <sighs> Did they talk about that earthquake at school today? 
No. Oh, they didn't? No. Hmm. I don't know. I like my answer, so like, I'm going to go with that. I like my answers. Although I like other answers, so now I'm not sure. Damn. There's so many answers I like. Yeah. Ah, okay. Now I only like one answer. My answer's stupid. And I should feel bad. Alright, now I like the correct answer, not the incorrect answer. If you want to get a, a membership on chess.com, then type exclaim premium and use my code and then I'll get some of the money, but you'll pay the same. Yeah, that's true. Really? Yeah. The, oh. uh, it's called being an affiliate. Oh. Yeah, exclaim premium. And then whatever's the most expensive, you should buy that. That's good for the stream. Somebody's late to the stream. Mm -hmm. It seems like it could be made if they're. I don't know. I I don't know. Rook Rook takes on c one. Yay! Bishop takes, and then I thought it was um, G takes on a. Uh -uh. Oh no! Ask Archer. Queen f six. Yeah, you play queen here, threatening that. Oh, I was trying I, to do the same thing. I thought this one because <laughs> I didn't see queen c five because I'm really good. No, but I was trying to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I was trying to do? We are trying to get in here. And yeah. queen takes, and then it's lined up on the F2. Right, but after takes, they don't take. Why didn't C go to F6? Yeah. I don't know. I'm not saying yeah. mine works. Yeah, and also they planning. can take back, and if you take, they can play queen B8 check and queen G3. Yeah. Darn. Okay, F4, continue. And then I already missed it. Someone get Ronaldo a TV. Yeah, after queen c5, queen a4, there's queen c8 check and queen takes knight for the person who mentioned that. That's right, Vin Breezy TV. Good job. Yeah, I mean, I guess you want to just take on Passant. Uh-huh. I was just making sure. Okay. Now, do you want to give your queen away for nothing or get out of check this way? Let's see. I think it's uh... yeah. I think you just go F two. Mm -hmm. Twenty seven seventy. Good job. Mm -hmm. Well, I missed stuff. Yeah, but close enough. <laughs> All right, next. Hey, we have the two bishops. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Band on the run. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like my answer. Oops. I think the phrase chicken scratch was invented for Bonarici's answers. And he's like typing it. So it's weird. Tomorrow, the high temperature 67. Yeah. 
Yeah. So if they let you go outside like at two o'clock, three o'clock, which they won't, then it's warm out. Yeah. Well, Leor ACDF still needs a, a wellness check. I don't know what you're doing. You write one legal move, then you write nonsense. Although all the answers in the chat are wrong, but still. I agree. I mean, you know, something. That is a good question. This guy's wondering about previous moves in this game, why they were played. Yeah. I can't help you. Harry STL. I wonder if he's her suit or his name is Harry. Either one's funny. I live in Israel. You live in Israel? Never heard of it. It's definitely not 4 a.m. because it's 9.37 p.m. here. Oh, yeah, then you can have a fish, yeah. It could be 4.37, but it can't be 4. Take a block for the night. At least the p.m. is funny. Darn, I'm not sure again. I mean, I see that I can take the rook with check, but then mm -hmm. I have the night block. Or... No, if you take this with check... Then rook d1, and your queen's hanging, and queen f7 is winning. Right. So you can't do that. The queen at, and the main reason you can't do why this. Why wouldn't they block with the knight? Because the rook attacks the queen. If they block with the knight, your oh, queen's not attacked. And that can reach her. Oh, okay. You can stop me. And, and the main reason this is wrong is that was the most popular answer in the chat. Well, I, yeah, I said I couldn't get it to work. Mm -hmm. Well, go ahead. I just don't know what to do. Yeah, you have to preface it with bishop e6 attacking the queen. I was looking at that. That way there's no mate on f7. And if he plays queen d1 um, to defend his rook, you play queen takes c3 check, and this rook is hanging. Darn. Well, yeah, now you can it. take the rook with check. Oh. Although then there's rook d1, then I give up. Although I still like that. I guess I can play queen h3 and attack the bishop, but only if archer says so. Yeah. Then knight g5. Then I can still take the bishop. Queen f7, king h8. I don't like that answer because I'm scared. But I do like taking this. On the other hand, I could take the knight, and then this rook's hanging and this rook's hanging. We could play rook here. Or I could take this rook, which I'm starting to like. Okay. After knight takes, queen takes, there's three pieces. So I don't know. It's either bishop takes rook or queen takes this rook. You think it's queen h1 archer like I do? Yeah. Okay. Darn. I was going to say so, bishop. Yeah. You know, this is three pieces for two rooks, which is close. Yeah, it was too hard. 2970. For me. Too hard for me. Mm hmm. It's too hard for everybody. <laughs> I did. Was that you, Harry? In Mongolia. The map of Ben's brain. I did. I was going to show it on the stream, too. Oh, yeah, I saw it in the thing. Yeah, I printed it. See, I got proof. I printed it out. Yeah, I don't know what you guys are talking about. Somebody sent me a um, phrenological map of your brain that they made because mm -hmm. they were bored, I guess. And I printed it out to show on the stream. And I, it's upstairs on the printer, and Archer said he saw it. This yeah. one's too hard. Okay, next. Yours, so next. Well, I'll show it next stream, or maybe I'll go grab it. This I'll one's too easy. I want one that's just right. Mm -hmm. This looks like a game I would have black in. Down a piece for nothing, attacking ridiculously, and then somehow I win. Yeah. 
my space. At who? Excuse me. At you. Sorry. Well, and Poker Bunny is a poker, but we have Cyber Bunny, and she's chess. Yeah. Cyber Bunny B. Much better than Poker Bunny. You don't eat honey. It's not vegan. Come on, Harry. Insane Lonely Bear using... Uh, emotes to answer the question. Good job. Oh, and then you could just move the pawn. That sounds right. Yes, I think it's uh, queen h6. And then you want to go g3. Mm -hmm. 2190. Not hard. I'm just slow. Mm -hmm. We ready? Yeah, I ate honey. And, I, you know. Gravel is vegan. There you go. I'm just not going to feel bad about some taking some beasts. But, I mean, I stopped eating meat. Check. There or there. There. I think I saw this. <clears throat> I'm going to write no solution and see how that works. <laughs> Salt in your food? No, I got nothing. This one's too hard for me. I know move one, but I don't know what move two is. But I do know move one. Oh, move two, he can't stop. Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought that stopped it, but I was wrong. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's right. Da -da. Then tower C8. No, you're not right. When you write the word tower, you're never going to be right. If you don't know the names of the pieces, it's hard to be right. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm not sure, but I can check. So there aren't a lot of choices uh -huh. here. So let's, let's at least get past the first move. Okay. I was thinking King H1. Correct. So that I can and then I couldn't, I couldn't get past Rook E8, which he's definitely going to play. Well, let, I don't want to be told. No, but he'd play it. That's fine. And then after looking for an hour and getting laughed at by Archer, I'm like, oh, that's the answer. Yeah. I'd never been laughed at so much. Well, I was looking previously because I looked at mm -hmm. this a little bit like 9F7, but. Yeah, that's not it. So that's I'll... not it. What a man, what a Oh, man. yeah, I guess you could just go King G8. It's Tower in German. Uh... That's correct. 
Go ahead. I just want to know this one. Archer. Queen e4. Yeah. I wanted to play queen e4, threatening mate, mm -hmm. but I thought rook e8 stopped it, but it doesn't. <laughs> because if you take the queen, rook c8 is going to be mate. Oh. So now I'm threatening queen takes rook and queen here, and I'm stopping mate. Oh, and also, yeah. more importantly, I'm threatening your tower. <laughs> this is just this is just the kind of puzzle you like. Yeah, three three thousand, <laughs> three thousand. That is an it. archer puzzle mm -hmm. all the way. <laughs> it's Lin sanity. Yeah, what was your pink puzzle writing? I don't know. Oh, you don't know. You don't really do one much. I'm currently at my peak puzzle reading. Go, Ben. I don't do puzzles anymore because I don't want to lose reading points. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. That's all I care about. Uh, let's see. There, 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 there. All right. <laughs> I can't believe I got it one second before Archer. Ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah, it shouldn't. You should get it one second before me. <laughs> Bless you. Your answer is incredibly wrong, Thaddeus. I don't mean your silliness. Your actual answer is really wrong. And the move you give an exclam to is a blunder. So I hope you're ashamed. The only thing to do is to give 50 subs. Then you're forgiven. And by 50, you should have misheard that as 15, and then you're good. Yeah. Well, there's a lot of me. All right. Rook B1. Rook B1? Yeah. And then... Um, this is the Ben Feingold kind of puzzle. One legal move. Yeah, and then Knight G4. Uh-huh. And then Knight F2. Yeah, Thaddeus said H5, double question mark. And then King H4, King G5, GG. Yeah, but your move is correct. Right, and then... This is where I wasn't... Completely uh, yeah, rook, rook h1. I couldn't see that in my head. Mm -hmm. I thought I had to go g5, but then once we got here, 2540. That was oh. wrong. Oh, okay. Yeah. And I have to use the restroom. Like Can you go for me? What? I have to use the restroom. Can you go for me? Because the stream's almost Any over. chance she'll bring me the phrenology map? Oh, yeah, sure. Thank you. What? Any chance? I could do it because I have to go to the bathroom. Oh, okay. Where is it? Archer, can you just give it to Ben? Where is it? He'll give it to you. Okay, I'll get it. What's the Archer's rating? Um, his over the board US chess rating is about seventeen hundred, but I don't know what his puzzle rating is. What did you guys name him Archer or why oh, why did we name him Archer? You know, it was just a name I liked and it was before the show Archer was popular. We'd already picked the name, and that was like about the time that the cartoon Archer came out, which I don't care for. But um, it was just a, game, a name that we liked. That was really all. He's 13. That was it. Let me see what you guys, I missed something. If you guys want to review any of the puzzles, yeah, he's really good for 13, you know, with the puzzles, especially because he never practices. Um, he's always been good at puzzles. From the first time he started, when he started playing, I mean, you just wouldn't believe how crazy good he was when he was um, six, I guess. Was he six or five? No, he was five. <clears throat> we were in Seattle. <clears throat> when... It wasn't there because a zombie took and ate the brain. <laughs> yeah, let me finish my story and then we can show it. I want to see. But um, 
Yeah, when I had Archer in, we went to Seattle when he was five, actually. And he did a camp um, during the day with um, Georgi. What's Georgi's last name? Orlov. Orlov. There, he had a, he has a chess club there. And, and after the first day, when I picked Archer up, Georgi said, are you Archer's mom? And I said, yeah. And he goes, I've never seen a kid do puzzles like this, and I've seen a lot of kids. He was that bad. <laughs> I'm cold. He was really good at puzzles. But he's never really wanted to study chess a whole lot. And so you know, it's hard to progress, even if you have some natural ability, <clears throat> if you don't study chess a lot. He studies some. So this this was the art, the fan art that Harry sent me. Are you on the stream still, Harry? Wherever you went, I think it was Harry. Mm-hmm. Was that the right name? Mm-hmm. Anyway, welcome to Ben's brain. Let me read it. A, a map of Ben's brain. Oh, that's funny. I didn't even see all that. It's got a Family Guy. I'm gonna show it to you guys in a minute. Family Guy. And the Simpsons, and some have been sayings, and all the sections of the brain. I don't know if you guys have seen those phrenology maps, obscure movie quotes. Hey, this is pretty good, per Perrier. So let me see if I can, if it's yeah. But where's the Mandula Viewable. Let me see. Yeah, that's good. Let me go back a little. And go back a little. Can you guys see it? I thought it was pretty cool. Mm-hmm. And um, that was emailed to me today, and I think it's pretty cute. Pretty, pretty, pretty cool. <laughs> it is. It is perfect, that is. I, very good job on the fan art. I don't know where you went, Harry, but thank you. There you are. Fave is one for each of you. <laughs> thank you, Harry St. Louis. Okay, ready? Or Harry Styles, maybe. <laughs> okay. Yeah, t-shirt idea. Mm -hmm. okay. This one I got one. quick. Archer would have got it quicker. It took me like a second and a half. Mm -hmm. It taking him half a second. All right, well, let's see if I can do it. That one's so clean, but... Got all these pieces. Three pieces. And no queen over him. I don't think that's right. So let's try this other one. Let's see. Check. Most of the chat is banned. There. I think you can block there. Oh, let's do a double check maybe. Let's see. Check. Oh, yeah, because we've got this other bishop. Yeah, I think it's um, bishop b4. Bishop b4 what? Oh, bishop b4. Like what? <laughs> like the word before. Okay. Yeah. One of my usual jokes. Um, Should be in the brain thing. Probably there. Then he goes back. Oh, no, we can't go back. Bishop uh, E2. Mm -hmm. 2460. That wasn't too bad. Elephant E2 is correct. Fan art or fart? I can hear the dog. Mm -hmm. Almost like he's in here. It was pretty loud. Mm -hmm. With the shaking. Ready? Yeah. What Light color to am move. I? Light. Okay.
Man, that took me a long time to solve it. I shouldn't have. I'm somewhat embarrassed. Darn. Now I feel bad because Archer would have solved it in like four seconds. <laughs> Damn. It's going to be like a minute. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Even the doofuses in the chat got it. I don't have it, so it yeah, make me feel bad. Come on. Well, I'm a doofus. No, but the chat got it before I did. I've never been so mad. It seems like he gets away in all my scenarios. Mm -hmm. Is see. Indo here? Somebody said, hi, Indo. It's got to be. Hey, Indo, if you're here. Yes, seen is banned. Why does Beyonce win Grammys? She can't play any musical instrument, write, play, sing. She can't do anything. What? At least Lizzo won something. She can do a lot of stuff. I've never been so angry. Also, she's better than Harry Styles because he's worse. But is it like is it like an ironic Grammys? It's like the worst. Is that how it is? That would make more sense. I mean, I'm not a huge fan, but I think she's talented. She's won 32 Grammys instead yeah. of like zero. Lizzo plays at least the flute and probably other no, things. No, Lizzo's too. good. Lizzo uh, won a Grammy too, but like, why is Beyonce winning a Grammy? And then, and then a country singer won a Grammy. Bonnie Raitt. Go Bonnie. Oh, Raitt. Bonnie won. Uh huh. And they were like, "Who's that?" Because you know that's our age. Darn! Why can't I see what this is? The best way to get to two thousand is to win a lot of games, and draw people that are high rated. Oh, no, I don't have that. That won't work. Lizzo is vegan, unless she's not anymore. People say they're vegan, but, you know. Yeah, Chuck D's good. If I go there and then they queen. Right, ethereal. Very good. And I can check. Then it's mate. Yeah, Eric Adams is also a suspicious vegan. People say they're vegan, but they eat a lot of meat. Yeah, I think that's right. Maybe. What? <laughs> King F5? Correct. Yay. Because you have to... Um, Always retreat. You don't want to be on the queen and square first You're, you're telling me? Yeah. And then... Okay, I didn't think that was going to be the next page. A check. Still the same thing, though. G5. Yeah. 2441. Yay. Did it. I'm just slow. Hey, Yasin. I can do some stuff, but I just take Wee. a while. Yeah, I can't. I knew that there was a mate, but I was just couldn't quite figure out what was going on. New chess drama just dropped. Quick, let's get on Ben's stream. Are you talking about the Joe Baba thing, or was there something else? Hey, Indo, how's it going? Oh, is she not legit? Is she vegan, Lizzo? She says she is. A lot of people say they're vegan and they're not. Yeah, I don't know much about her. I love her as a personality. Yay. Yay, Indo. All right, let's do another one. Mm. I guess we're going to be done soon, aren't we? Uh-huh. Okay. 
Well, did you have a favorite album of 2022? We can't listen to music in 2022. So, no. We had least favorite albums. Oh, snap. All of them. We go to, like, uh, symphonies and stuff. We don't, you know, we can't be listening to music now. <laughs> it's, it's all nonsense now. I mean, I don't feel that way, but... I'm not. You I'm not up name, on you, it. You can't name a song from 2022. That's not because I'm disdainful of it. It's, I'm disdainful it's because I'm busy. And also, sometimes the people who sing those songs and make those albums, sometimes they're on my lawn, and I'm like, get off my lawn. Can't believe they're on my lawn. I was telling a cloud about it one day. Okay, so I'll set up this check. Let's see. That. Sarah. My favorite song is Ben's intro song. Exactly. Let's go up. Check. Even Homer won a Grammy. Go Homer. I'm not sure about all the news. I think um, mm -mm. I was looking at Rookie 5. Mm -mm. No? Mm -mm. Oh, well, go ahead. Only then. one of my rules works here. Put it in H. Yeah. He wants to go here when you check and run away. Oh, just so do that play first. play here so he can't run oh, away. Oh, yeah. So he's either going to play King G. That was going to be my second move. Yeah, he's either going to play King G5 or Bishop F4. I have no idea which one. He's going to play one of them. Mm-hmm. Th that one. Yeah, um, yeah. I think you just uh, take it, take the bishop, bishop, the bishop, mm. bishop f four. Yeah. And then uh, rook e five. Mm -hmm. Twenty six ninety one. That's a good one to end on because you solved it. Well, hey, we have two thousand viewers. I didn't Yay. get. I didn't get. I didn't solve it. I got the last part of it. You didn't solve it? Oh. No. I don't know. I missed the first move. We'll do another one then? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Always one more. <clears throat> okay. I have solved it. And then some. Yeah, but thinking's not your strong suit. Don't do that. Cold. Hmm. Trying to learn said he won his informal company blitz tournament going undefeated. So I said all draws? Yeah, undefeated is not a, a word you use in chess because draws and stuff. Oh, then there's the night check. Yes, I think it's C takes B5. Mm hmm. And then A takes, and then knight D5. Not only is it mate, but it wins the queen. Mm-hmm. 
I'm going to say 2170. Yeah, it was pretty easy. 2640. What? Yeah, that's a good one to finish on. <laughs> that was easy, though. You guys are the best. All right, hang on before we leave. So, you guys, if you want to review the puzzles from the stream one more time, <clears throat> if you don't know your way around chess.com, I'll give you the link. Who should I raid? Go, hang on a second. Yeah. Go to the link there. Oh, I say it in the instructions. Scroll down and click on the learning tab, and you can go back over the puzzles. And then who should we raid? Yeah, because there's like four or five choices. Um... You know, I would do either this this one, this one, or that one. One of those three. Yeah, the first two was a zero percent chance. I was yeah, waiting for I was waiting for your third one. I was <laughs> like, which one are you gonna pick? <laughs> okay. All right, bye guys. I hope you enjoyed the stream. Thanks for watching the we stream. Did. You guys are the best. See you tomorrow.